Hello, it's me. Uh, it's, uh, like, not that long until raid time, and, uh, you know what? We are, indeed, falling, as it were, and as it do. <clears throat> With that being said, what are we doing today? Well, I am putting on music, because I'm gonna treat this like I'm streaming, and I'm gonna listen to a song. What song am I gonna listen to? Uh, apparently I didn't put the song that I wanted to listen to actually in my, um, my library, because I'm kinda stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, there we go. I'm not gonna download them, I'm not gonna download them. But I will add them to the library for streaming purposes. And that has a double meaning, because it's like, I'm streaming the music, and then also I'm normally listening to music when I'm streaming and not recording videos. With that being said, we're here. We're absolutely here. Um... I think I'm just gonna try to record as many videos <laughs> tonight as I can. Listen, you're 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 staring. I, I'm I'm staring down the barrel of a gun, which is ammunition is world of horror, and currently is only got one bullet in it, and that's this. And uh, it's character exclusive seventh curse random item random item statistics, huh? Oh, it's her. She's here. Um. But I recently caught up with, uh, caught up with, a uh, caught up on Siamese songs. Is that how you pronounce the band name? I'm pretty sure it is. But the, 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 you know, this is appealing to popularity. But the guys who did the, the Wolf, that's a really good one. Um, but they released a new album recently called Home, and it kind of, it kind of bangs. It kind of bangs. Uh, it's, it's at least easy listening, I guess I could say. Very, very vi- it's got the vibes. Uh, not necessarily comfy vibes, but it's got the vibes. Um, but anyways, you know, we've got, um... Your seconds, strength, charisma, dexterity. Uh, dexterity is actually possible because we're playing jury, it's look who it is, but... I'm a little bit- there, there's no item requirements, just your seconds, Takashi everything but knowledge, which is a little bit of a bummer because knowledge is way more viable as a stat, but eh, it is what it is. I don't think we're gonna get a compass. I don't I don't think we're gonna get a compass. You know, if Panstash wanted to buff Jury, like make her stupidly good, give her a starting weapon that's not dog shit. Like unironically, that that would make Jury an infinitely better character. Um but, like, that would probably make her too good, admittedly. But, uh, if you wanted to make Jury a worse character, just, like, minus all of her stats by one... <laughs> that, that would make her pretty bad. <laughs> Yo, if she started with, like, an army knife, that would be so interesting. That, that would genuinely be, like, hmm, curious. But we have to, the problem is we have to deal with, uh, character exclusive, or not character exclusive perks. We have to deal with, um, ooh. I mean, I'm not gonna say no, but we're probably gonna use that in a minute. I'll use this one more time. Ah, but I don't wanna, I, I, we need to have this. Because it's random item statistics, so a weapon that normally costs four could cost five. So we, we need to, unfortunately, bite the bullet there. We need to sell that. Uh, I'm gonna put up the Emmerdale this time, because I'm not absolutely gobsmacked. But, um... Let's see, let's see... Alright. We've seen... I was gonna say we've seen Jury. That would be... I mean, you're looking at Jury right now, she's on your screen. Uh, Jury jump scare. sorry, I should've warned you. Painting? I mean... There's really no point, but what if we did it anyways, you know? Also, in hindsight, the idea that the flashlight buffs the chainsaw is kind of based, because you're encouraged to buy one before you go to the mystery. You usually buy the weapon, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, bulletin, ramen, hell, mermaids, p painting. Um... Hmm. 
I'm thinking about it. I'm actually having to give it a good think. I have a couple anecdotes to go through, but I can't even get into them because my brain is being used for something. Um, what's the order here? Bulletin in the painting? But do we get the chainsaw? I don't know. I'm thinking about it. We'll, we'll we'll give it a try. Let, let let's see. What what do we got here? We need to be super careful with the with the horror meter. Ah, uh, the library notes were worth no money. Good, good, good. Okay. Th th this is not great. <laughs> but we're seeing, okay? Oh, thank God. Okay. Oh. oh! Okay, um, a little spicy. We do need to go to the forest twice, thank god the forest is safe. Uh, 30% horror meter right off the bat, broken nose, who cares? Full health right now, I, I don't have to worry about that. Oh, speaking of being full health, hold on. Should probably go ahead and do this. Bromel is knowledge? I mean, it's worth it, it is. We're not on Katurufu, so yeah, it is just worth it. Now, admittedly, we are hoping that we do not just eat 8 million sanity damage immediately. Because that would be nice, you know? Yeah, that'd just generally be okay. Uh, now, Jory is not having a good day, but I had an alright day. Um, you know, every time... This is going to be a weird pivot, but I, I met one of my neighbors like a few weeks back. Uh, she was, like, a, a nice, older, like, elderly woman, and, you know, it's just, like, common courtesy, like, to tell them that they need help, because, I mean, they don't have any family near here, you know, uh, to tell them that they need help, that you can help them out, and so they, uh, they hit me up, and they were telling me about how their, uh, their TV's not working, and I mean, man, every single time, you know, you, you interact with, like, your grandparents or just somebody who's elderly in general, they get fleeced, man. They, they get scammed so hard. Like, th this is somebody who, they don't, ha they don't have internet, okay? Now, for me, you know, unthinkable, right? Like, I, I, I would never be able to live like that, but they, they don't need the internet. They, they don't use it. They have a, they have like a satellite thing, right? And my God, they, they went to the store to ask about getting a TV because they wanted to get a TV so they could watch stuff. You know, like they could watch TV and their old TV wasn't working properly. It was broken or something. So so they go to get this TV and they she says that she doesn't get uh, that she doesn't have internet. And these motherfuckers upsell her on a fucking like smart TV that 99% of its features need internet connection. Like, it, seriously, these guys can go fuck themselves. It's fucking crazy, man. And it, it's so, like, wh wh where's your shame as, like, a human being? Like, it, like, come on, man. So I'm, like, over there helping her set up her TV. And this thing is, again, it's a fucking smart TV. And the remote that it has is, like, it's one of those remotes that, like, has just a bunch of buttons to bring you to, like, a bunch of streaming services or some shit that she can't use. And so it's, like... She can't use, like, 90% of the features on her TV. And it's so fucking, like, the, the, uh, like, well, again, wh what happened to shame? <laughs> right? Like, what happened to shame? Like, just scamming, like, an, uh, like, an older person to get them to buy a TV that they, that, like, this really, ex like, this, like, almost a hundred dollar TV where 99% of its features don't work because she doesn't have an internet connection. Like, oh my god, man. And so the, the the only thing that she can do on it is, like, watch live TV. Like, antenna live TV. And it's like, Jesus fucking Christ, man. And, and I'm having to explain to her, like, yeah, no, this... None of these buttons on your remote will work because these are all, like, streaming service stuff that's online only. And then... 
You can't handcuff this guy, he's not human. But that's such a mean thing to say about him. He's more he he's as human as me or you. Such a rude thing to say about your guy right here. Um But yeah, no, it, it's just like crazy, man. Are, are we are we taking the damage here? Oh god, please don't tell me we're taking the I think we gotta run. Or, alternatively, we throw the bottle at him, and it does 80 million damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So here, here's what we have to do. Here, here's, what, here's what has to line up. We have to brace here, and we have to hit this attack. We miss that attack. I'll do it again, just because we need to commit to... We're committing to the bit here. I really don't want to run away. Okay, you gotta run away. You gotta run away, I'm sorry. You do. It's true. You, you, you absolutely have to run away here. It's completely unacceptable to miss two 60% chances in a row, right? Like that. Now, admittedly, you look at our EXP here, you look at our horror meter, and you're like, yeah, it's Jover. Do, do keep in mind we're getting a chainsaw, so it's not that bad. It's still pretty bad, though. But yeah, no, it's... Um, and you know, the, like, the, this is more of an anecdote from, like, when I was uh, back in the Scotland arc, but, like, my grandma, she would get calls, like, every day from scammers. It was fucking crazy, man, and I had to tell her, like, I, well, I didn't have to tell her, because she, she's been getting, people have been trying to scam her for, like, a decade and a half now, but, you know, like, it, it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy, like, just how, like, predatory this shit is. Like, when somebody becomes, like, elderly, and they don't really understand, like, all this new shit, and here's the thing, I'm gonna be the exact same thing. If you think I'm gonna be different, if you think I'm gonna, and if you think you're gonna be different, when your fucking grandkids are coming over, and one of them has like three bionic arms, and their eyeballs have been replaced by uh, like a computer screen visor, and you're asking them how your fucking TV works, you're not gonna know how that shit works. Your your kid, your grandkids are gonna come over. They're gonna humor you. They're gonna help you get that shit figured out. So if you think like, oh man, I'll be different, I'll be hip, I'll be cool, it'll happen to you. You used to be, you're hip with it now, but eventually it's gonna change. And then you're gonna have no idea what it is. And then it's gonna change again before you can even comprehend the last thing. And then you're just gonna be completely just behind and you're gonna be scared. And so try to have a good relationship with your kids and your grandkids, God bless. Or your nephews. Is there like grand nephews, grand nieces, something like that? Anyways. Oh. Alright. This is not OSHA certified. Under any circumstance, but here we are. Oh, and we're gonna make this a lot better, absolutely. Oh, let's go. I can't believe I threw like that, but that's okay. This is gonna suck. Jury is not OSHA certified. Her ass is not driving the forklifts legally. But she is driving the forklift. Jury moment. But, uh, yeah, no, like... It, it really is just disheartening to see it, because it's like... If you don't have, like... Essentially, if if you don't have like younger family members to take care of you, you're 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 screwed. Like it really is like so despairing like that, and it's just like oh my god. Because again, it's like I'm setting up this TV for her, and every single setting has to be like either manually turned off or like ignored or like be like fake setup, but it can't work because it just doesn't. There's no internet, so it doesn't work. And and you fucking sell somebody that? Like what a like what a fucking degenerate. Like I I, I don't know how you could like go to sleep at night, like having some older person, like some elderly person, shop at your store, and then you sell them something that they that they can use to the very bare minimum. And I mean she couldn't even set it up because she tried to set it up before, but she couldn't get past the fucking Wi-Fi screen. Because she didn't know what Wi-Fi was. She didn't know, like, she thought it was an uh, antenna. Because of the symbol. <laughs> and it's like, man. It, it's so, it's so shitty. It's so shitty. 
because it, it, it's like she doesn't know how any of the, how any of this stuff works, and and you sell her a smart TV. It's like Jesus Christ, man, Jesus. I, I wouldn't be able to sleep at night if I did that shit. All right, here's what we're gonna have to do. I cannot believe we're doing this for Leech for Leech Girl. But, uh, we are... Ah, oh, shit. Oh, let's go! I clicked it in time. <laughs> but yeah, no. It, it, it's completely crazy. Like, I, I, I don't even I don't even know what to say. Right? Like, I, I don't even know what to say. It's just, like, I, I would not be able to, to live with myself if I was, like, involved in a fleece like that. Like, that's so, like... Like, if, if you're younger, you know better, right? You, you, you grew up with this stuff, it makes sense to you, you use it every day in your life. But somebody who didn't grow up with that, who didn't grow up in the sort of like tech environment that we all live in now, where it's like everybody's got a supercomputer that could fly you to the moon and back uh, in their pockets. Some people have those supercomputers on their wrists. Um, or in their glasses. Google tried to make that happen. But like... Seriously, man, it's fucking crazy. Oh! Uh, this is an injury, right? Yeah, 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 it's fine. Tiny cuts? Nobody, don't even care. But yeah, no, like, uh, if you have, like, elderly people in your life, you, you already know that there's, like, entire industries that are, like, targeted to try to fleece them with for as, as much money as possible. And you already know, like, Dear God, how bad it is, but yeah, no, it, it's bad. My grandkids are gonna be coming over to my like old ass house that I refuse to sell to the multi billionaire uh, neo tech guru who has like a commercial uh, like space flight business to a casino on Mars. And uh, just around my house is just, like, the most, like, neon tech stuff you could ever see. And then there's just, like, this dainty-ass, like, 2010s-looking-ass house there. They're, they're gonna be like, hey, hey, granddad, what do you mean you need help with the, the latest, uh, <laughs> the latest fucking updating your internet browser? And it's like, you know, back in my day, your internet browser had a pop-up and you click, click update. But now you have to do all this, this Neuralink shit. Yeah, they're they're gonna be ha they're gonna have to be patient with my ass. Absolutely. Oh yeah, just casual three damage. That's really nice. Now the good thing is um we can't kill the enemy uh, realistically in one turn. We don't actually need the HDF. We might need it later. It could have been a surprise tool to help us later, but it uh, evidently was not currently. Oh, no. No, no, no! <laughs> you piece. Okay, hold on. Oh, God, there's no way to make it happen. All right, let's see it. Let's see the failure. Oh, thank God, I already made it. We're, we're, we're alive. We're so back. Do I need plus two dexterity? I don't really think I need plus two dexterity, to be honest with you. Um, well, it is everything but knowledge. But we have something like taking our dexterity away, don't we? I wish I could check. But we're three dexterity normally, is that correct? Is that worth it for 4% horror meter? We're going to level up again, so... Eh, let's just... Mm. I don't know, man. All these are useless. But we go up to five? But that's still way too much of an investment to dexterity. That's way too much of an investment to dexterity. Now, I highly doubt we're going to get to level five because stuff like that happens regularly. You should stick together in the weird mansion. True, true, my mistake. Thank God, that's the sanity one. <laughs> There's like so many mansion events that are just scary as hell. Blood Moon? Brother, I'm playing Jury. Listen, I I, I played a few Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duels last night and I hated every, I hated every one of those, those rounds. Uh, there was a game that I played where 
I am playing my Reptiles deck, which is dog shit. Uh, it's one of the worst decks in the game, and I hadn't crafted my last Ultra Rare yet, so really, if you just had one monster in your monster zone, I lost immediately. Like, there was basically nothing I could do. Uh, I crafted that Ultra Rare, actually. I, I opened a 10 be I, I opened a 10 piece and ended up getting, uh, like, a couple of Ultra Rares that I could disenchant. So I made Numeron, finally. So I have the numeron Dragulabon combo or whatever. So there was one really good game I had where my opponent and I, I bricked. I drew Venomina and Venomanaga and Rise of the Snake Deity and Offering of the Snake Deity in my opening hand with fucking Ugdoadic Serpent Strike or whatever the hell it's called. We have three mysteries to go, and I've got nine minutes. I've got five minutes! <laughs> go, go, go! Um, but that game lasted until turn seven. And I managed to win by doing the Dra Dragulabon Numeron combo. And that was pretty satisfying. But there was a game that I had earlier where I played a Naoya, and Naoya is a, a bad card. <laughs> it basically, I can send it, you, you're gonna know exactly where this is gonna go uh, immediately. Oh, I forgot that's the Doom one and not the Sanity one. I always get that confused with the other one. But, um, you know. Oh, Drenched? The chainsaw is rusty? Yo, bro, that's crazy. Um,. Our perception's pretty good, though, admittedly. Uh, do we have fetid fumes? No, we don't. Are we on Gazoo? No, we aren't. But, um... Oh, Broken Nose! Funny moment! Best of Broken Nose. Is Broken Nose a minor injury? I feel like it can't be cured anyways. Eh, fuck it. I only needed to heal plus two anyways. Um, that's gonna come to bite me in the ass later, probably. Uh, just retreat from the room, that's fine. But, uh, can we get out of this mystery immediately? Not because I want to win, but because I've got two minutes remaining. Two minutes remaining. Um, but I, I, I just had, like, the worst opening hand of all time. And my opponent didn't do anything. He was playing Dark Ma He was playing Dark Magician, so, like, obviously he wasn't doing anything. But, um, you know, he just, like... The game ended, <laughs> like, it, it was so funny. Uh, sorry, going back to the Naoya game. Naoya allows me to sacrifice it for, uh, from my hand to the graveyard, and then I'm able to um, get another reptile and put it in the graveyard. It's bad. Uh, it has to be a light reptile too, right? Because Naoya's a, a dark reptile, and so that's how the Ogdoadix work. Um, but anyways. Oh god, I really am gonna be late. No, no, get me out of here, man! Get me out of here! But, um... Basically, I, I, I played Naya, and it's a bad card. It's not a combo starter. It would've let me get, like, one monster on the board. <laughs> and it got... It got Ash Blossomed. Then, my opponent set two cards, played a monster, and then I had nothing, but I top decked another Naoya, and I'm like, oh yes, finally. And so I play the Naoya, and it, the set card was called by the grave. <laughs> and so both of my Naoyas got fucking... It, it, it was like turn four or five, because my opponent bricked too. And then I just had to wait for like 11 minutes for him to do the Blackwing combo, and then I finally got to go. I finally got to leave. Can, can we just say how much, uh... Oh, she's... Oh, she's weak! Funny moment! Can I just say how much I, uh, despise Black Wings? <laughs> oh, I... I they, like, Black Wings are neat, but, like, oh my god. It, it's just so miserable, and so many people play them. Especially that one card that's, like, an Omni-Negate when it's in the graveyard. You hate to see something like that. Going out to coffee with the horror. Me and Bestie. Me and Bestie Rutsu. I need to actually get, like... I need to actually get, um... You know what? Remove. The broken nose. 
because unfortunately the horror is very self-conscious about its appearance, and so the broken nose takes away its ability to, you know, rest and have a good time. But uh, I, I just hate, like, when you're in a Yu-Gi-Oh game and there's nothing you can do and your opponent has lethal and then they insist on comboing you for, like, six more minutes for, like, just for style points. Because, like, this motherfucker had 8,000 attack on the board, but they weren't synchros. And he was playing Black Wings, so obviously he wants to get the synchros out. So he's, like, he just, like, getting every single fucking synchro out. And it's like, all right, man, could you just fucking kill me? Like, could you just, like, could, can you just, like, put the gun to my head and pull the trigger? You motherfucker. <laughs> All right, this is gonna be a lot of doom. This is gonna be a lot of doom. Also, I gotta say, hold up, I'm, I'm gonna be a little bit late. I'm gonna be a little late. Uh, I'm gonna uh, be a little late. I'm gonna be a little late. This is like a little treat, you know? One fund, satisfactory price, love to see it. Get me the hell out of here. Yeah, I still gotta run through this whole, whole ass mystery here. So, you know, we got, uh... what if I just, died so we're gonna we're gonna rest so that i don't just die but yeah no i i just like seriously he could have ended the game but he just kept going and it, that's like the most annoying thing in Yu-Gi-Oh, man that's the most annoying thing in Yu-Gi-Oh, is like when somebody can just can just win the game but they're like no i don't want to win the game why would i want to win the game when i can uh, combo for 80 minutes and it's like oh you son of a bitch You, you really do, you really do hate to see it. Alright, he's weak? Okay. I'm pretty sure this is just instantaneous death, but we'll, we'll do an extra attack in case it isn't. Oh my god, it wasn't! Oh, I'm not, I'm not stacking attack here. Oh, jeez. We need to rest one more time? You love to see it. Do you think I remember my second enemy? Oh, you absolutely bet your ass I don't. Are you trying to... Wait, no, this... I die... Wait, I'm gonna die if I miss this attack? What the hell? He takes bonus? Okay. So that's six damage. That's pretty good. So just two of these, huh? Just, just two, of, two of these gets the job done. Not even gonna, like, uh, worry about it. We're just gonna die to sanity damage because I don't want to rest again. Sounds cool, sounds cool. Uh, do we just go for it? I mean, we have to rest, though. Like, that's the problem. Okay. Here, here's where it gets a little bit sketchy. Here's where it gets a little bit sketchy. <laughs> Money, huh? Don't suppose I can, uh... Don't suppose I could tempt you with anything else? No? Okay. I- I don't know, I don't know what you want me to do. Uh, I got nothing. Like, I- I- I mean, we have insomnia, so, like, we're kind of fucked, but, you know... I mean, we have to do that. And then we have to, like... Oh, maybe I could've... Actually, there's some shit that I can do, I think. I, I think I could have done this in a better way. I think I could have done this in a better way. But what we're, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna burn it all down. This, depending on our doom increase, might be possible. Like, the doom increase of the lighthouse. If I remember the first two. Like, if I don't remember the first two, it's impossible, but... Um... I don't even remember what the first two are. It's hopeless. It's over. This is a good episode, though, I think. Despite going four minutes over time, that's a little bit unfortunate. So we're taking, um... Oh, we're at, I didn't actually have to worry about our sanity at all. I'm stupid. We're, we're not even... We're just taking, uh, minus six, minus three. Okay. Yeah, no, I, I was dumb. I, I threw. That, that was, a uh, web weaver throwing? No, I would never throw. Homeboy... <laughs> Brother. The fuck do you want from me? Hold on. Okay. Just pray to God. Like, whatever God you believe in, just pray. That's... That sucks. That's awful. 
like genuinely blood moon moment. I I'm curious. Do I am I gonna get to try on the second enemy? I am. Okay. You. <laughs> okay, that's fine. We were dead anyways. It didn't matter. Ugh. Anyways, stay safe out there. Have a good one. Um. Yeah. No, that's that's it. Stay safe out there. Have a good one. I gotta go. I gotta. I, I had to go five minutes ago. So fuck you. I'm gone.